<clears throat> Ultimate Waffles here, back at you. So I know I said I would start the series today. I'm sorry. I promise it'll be somewhere in the weekends. Um, but ah, uh, that's not what I'm here to talk about. I'm here to talk about Skyrim and Fallout being in the same universe. I know what you're thinking. No way. But also, there is lots of evidence that it is a huge possibility that that could be a truth. <clears throat> For instance, in the Brotherhood of Steel Pridwin, you can find Nern Roots, but they are called Experimental Plant. But their code is NRT, Nern Root. Case closed. Um. There is more. It could also be that the radiation was cleared off in millions and millions of years. I'm basically saying it is possible for the Elder Scrolls to be thousands of years after Fallout. What happens to all the technology? In the culture of the Elder Scrolls, <clears throat> there is the Dwemner. They were erased by their own technology. Technology gets you killed. They harnessed magic. Oh, there's no magic in Fallout, you say. There in Fallout 2, there's an entire mission about a magical ghost. There's magic. The scientist harnessed the magic. Why would you want to use technology when you can shoot fire out of your hands, huh? So basically what I'm saying, it's very possible that giant bugs, giant creatures, giants all together, could be from Fallout. Like, let's talk actual Fallout. Actual Fallout would have cleared out by millions and millions of years because of the actual scientific process. Basically what I'm saying is Fallout came first. And then millions and millions of years, cat people and lizard people settled and it became medieval times they started over they didn't give up because life finds a way